Hey everyone, welcome back. In this hands-on video, I'm going to talk about the best tips and tricks to fix Genmoji not working on iPhone and iPad. For folks who have a liking for fun-loving emojis, Genmoji is an exciting feature. What makes it such a hot new add-on is the ability to let you create custom emojis on demand. Unfortunately, a handful of users have reported that Genmoji is not working on their iPhones or iPads. If this issue has hit your path as well, I have got you covered with some handy fixes. That's it, let's get started. First off, I would recommend you to make sure your device meets the hardware and software requirement. Bear in mind that Apple intelligence driven Genmoji requires A17 Pro and a higher chip or Apple M1 and a higher chip. Therefore, make sure your device is in line with this feature. And as for the software requirement, be sure your device is running iOS 18.2 or iPadOS 18.2 or later. It's worth pointing out that Apple intelligence is currently not available in the EU. Then I would recommend you to force quit the Apple Messages app on your device. If there is a minor software glitch, force quitting the Messages app will let you resolve the problem. To do so, you just have to swipe up from the home bar and then swipe up the Apple Messages app card. And then you have to launch the Messages app and check if Genmoji has begun to work as expected. Then I would recommend you to ensure that Genmoji is not blocked on your iPhone or iPad. To do so, just open the Settings app on your iPhone or iPad. And then you have to scroll down a bit and choose Screen Time. After that, select Content and privacy restrictions. Then select intelligence and Siri. After that choose image creation and then select allow option. And then I would recommend you to disable enable iMessage because this tip has worked for many users. To do so open the settings app on your device and then you have to scroll down to the bottom of the screen and choose the apps option. After that select messages. And then you have to turn off the toggle right next to iMessage. After that you have to restart your device and then turn the iMessage toggle back on. And finally, I would recommend you to update the software on your device. Should Genmoji continue to malfunction on your device, try updating the software as I suspect that a software bug might be causing the problem. To do so, open the settings app on your device and then choose General. After that, select Software Update, and then you have to download and install the latest update, and that's about it. So, these are the best tips and tricks through which you'll be able to fix Genmoji not working on iPhone and iPad. Hopefully, you have gotten the better of the problem, and the peel of Genmoji has begun to work as expected. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share it, and do subscribe to our channel for more such handy iPhone and iPad tips and tricks. I'll catch you up in the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.